For more perspective on the Republican battle, we're joined by CBS News political director John Dickerson. Good evening, John. John Romney has a sizable lead in the polls in New Hampshire. So how important really are these debates going to be? Well, Romney's opponents are going to try to make them important. Newt Gingrich's spokesman said tonight was fight night. Another Republican veteran said he expected Newt Gingrich to be so ready to attack Romney, he'd come on stage in a black cloak carrying a side. Sant his Santorum advisor said Romney should wear a flak jacket. If it doesn't change the result here in New Hampshire, his opponents hope to soften Romney up for the coming contest in South Carolina. If somebody doesn't emerge in South Carolina, John, is this race essentially over if someone doesn't challenge Romney there? Well, in conversations with GOP strategists, that the feeling is that Romney's advantage in money and organization, plus the fact that his opponents are splitting the anti-Romney vote, make it very likely he'll be the nominee. The question is just how the story ends and how bruised he gets. Well, is there a risk then that the Republicans could end up damaging their own frontrunner in the debates tonight and tomorrow morning? There is that possibility that Romney's public image is battered, that these debates provide moments Democrats can later use against Romney, or that conservatives already distrustful of Romney get more so, which lowers enthusiasm for the general election. But Republicans have rallied together after bruising fights before. And this year, Anthony, they have a really strong motivation, and that's they all want to beat Barack Obama. John Dickerson in New Hampshire. Thanks, John.